<laughs> What's up, son? <laughs> Look, I'm going to play basketball later on. You want to go? <laughs> son, you cannot beat... Son, son, you cannot beat me. Look, you have to stop this. Just stop doing this to yourself. All right, look. I look I'm going to come pick you up before I go. All right? All right. <laughs> what is going on? What's up, boy? What's up, Dad? You ready? Yeah. <laughs> I put your seatbelt on. <laughs> oh, me, Ty. Hey, what's up, man? Yo, first off, shout out to all the fathers out there that's there for their kids in every way imaginable. We really appreciate y'all. To the men that's halftime fathers or not fathers at all, it really hurts the kids when you're not around. But when you tell them things like you're gonna do something for them, then you don't do it. That destroys them. Just be there for your kids, man, because the kids, they did not decide to be here, but you had them, then you decide not to be there. I mean, it's. It's crazy how so many guys are trying to be halftime fathers. Today you feel like being a father so you go pick the kids up. Then they don't hear from you for the rest of the year. I mean, dude, either you're going to be there or you're not going to be there. Because kids will heal over time when they don't expect anything from you. But when you jump in and out there in life like you want to be there but you're not really there. You're doing nothing but opening a wound, reopening the wound, and pouring salt in it. I mean, dude... Just be there for your kids, man. If you're not going to be there, don't be there. Because there's no such thing as a part-time father. It's either you're not a father or you are a father. I'm getting upset. Uh, look, man. Like this video. Share this video. Follow me on Instagram at Jeremy L. Holloway. Like my page on Facebook at Jeremy L. Holloway. All my social media is at Jeremy L. Holloway. I really appreciate y'all, man.